Hey, Metro City. When the world's greatest superhero hangs up his cape. I'm, I'm done. It'll take a new kind of hero to save us. Wait, what? You need to be that guy. Well, this is a strange turn of events. Like me, Megamind is devilishly handsome. He starts out evil. <laughs> Don't panic, Roxy. I'm not panicking. I'm on my way. Oh, I'm shaking in my custom baby seal leather boots. And then he actually becomes good. Maybe I don't want to be the bad guy anymore. <laughs> Who are you? Evil is running rampant through the streets. I'm so tired of running rampant through the streets. Roxanne Ritchie is a reporter in Metro City. Metro Man and Megamind have been battling for years, and Roxanne is always the pawn in between, and, and she complains about it, but she also kind of likes it. You left us in the hands of him! No offense. No, I'm with you. Megamind needs a new good guy to fight, so he develops this superhero and that's what he thinks will be the end of all of his troubles. But Titan has a mind of his own and is really not being a proper good guy. A new threat has come to Metro City. Consider yourselves under new management. If we don't find Titan's weakness, he'll destroy the whole city. Megamind has a, has a very uh, unique sidekick in Minion. I play Minion, uh, Megamind's right-hand fish. Is a kind of interesting contraption of a of a fish swimming around in a fishbowl. With a gorilla robot body. Minion has gorilla parts as well. I forgot that. I did it! You did it, sir. Yes, you've made that perfectly clear. Megamind is the boss, wears the pants in the family. He's welcome to wear those pants because I wouldn't find those comfortable at all. Just a few alterations and I will be done with your cape. I'm calling it the Black Mamba. I found it very freeing to do an animated film because you could improvise as much as you want. A big huge shoe with flames coming out of it. Two tanks sword fighting or two swordfish like flying through the air stabbing other fish. And also to just be able to show up in jeans and a t-shirt and come out looking like a sassy reporter in a pencil skirt. That's the way to do it. Well, you don't have to shave, that's pretty fun. To me it's a very fun creative process because you're forced to just close your eyes and imagine where you are, what you're doing, what you look like. What's behind me right now? Huh. I wouldn't have guessed that. Intrigued? Yeah, you should be. Let the showdown begin! Oh, there's soaring, and there's capes, and there's magic guns, and there's speeding bullets. Anyone can do good. I think it's a very positive message. It's got really cool action, and it's, and it's hysterical. It's awesome, and I'm awesome in it. Hit it!